was perfect. Uh, look, look, thank you everyone for coming today. Um, thank you very much for coming to our launch of our new company, H-Drive. H-Drive is a specialist zero emissions distributor in Australia, specialising in hydrogen and battery electric vehicles. It's our intention to potentially invest in the area uh, for our manufacturing um, and our vehicle deployment within the area. So 20 years ago, we were running hydrogen buses in London. And now, 20 years later, we see some buses behind us, which is great. Um, it's great to have them here finally. And the guinea pigs have run through with the buses, and we know what all the problems are, and what all the challenges are and what we need to do to engineer these vehicles for our conditions. Our double-decker bus has been brought to the Illawarra to demonstrate that hydrogen fuel technology is real, it works, and to highlight the fact that it's been around for long enough now to show that it's a viable technology for use in the commercial transport industry. H-Drive have the largest portfolio of heavy vehicle, passenger vehicle, commercial vehicles available in Australia today. We have solutions in both battery electric and hydrogen fuel cells, vehicles from 4.5 tonne to 70 tonne in the commercial, and 13 passengers to 100 passengers, which you can see here in the varying range of size of vehicles. think differently but you also have to recognise the government's got to recognise that the sector itself can't do it alone. It's got to be an enormous cost. But you know let me leave you with some numbers. You know there's a two billion dollar health and environment saving if you transition the eight thousand diesel buses to zero emissions. You know it's not just about our environment, it's about our health. I, I know because there hasn't been the, the testing done, but certainly in cities like London, the transport corridors are poisoning the people. Now that $2 billion of savings to health and environment should be put straight back into the work that's being achieved here by H-Drive, 
and everybody else that's trying to get off the ground with this new technology in New South Wales. No ifs, no buts. I also could make the point, state governments can't do it alone. National government's got to be involved. Because it's going to come at a big cost. We've got no option. And governments won't hit their targets unless transport is able to hit its. And that's a massive change for everybody. So I'm very excited to be here today and see it. Um, I can assure you there is, and there was method to my madness to try to issue a challenge. Um, because it is about saving lives. 